Okay, you guys know know this man as Israel Boone because that's the way he still looks, right? <laughs> yeah, they look at this hairy face and go, oh yeah, that was Israel. Yeah, from Daniel Boone, see? Uh-huh. Yeah. But you were. Oh, I was, yes. yes. That was a couple of years ago. It was a couple of years ago. Yes, it was. But you have been doing consistent work forever, ever since, and you're about to be in a big giant, and I love Christmas. I, I've already decorated for Christmas because I'm that person. You are that person. I'm that person. You, but you you're have the Christmas carols already playing. Yes. Yeah, okay. Even in my head right now. That's great. Yeah. Well, that's just like the character in this uh, Christmas movie I got coming out. I know. And I'm so excited. And you are in one of the very first Christmas movies on Hallmark, right? It actually kicks off the Hallmark Christmas season. Yes. And it's called Christmas Wishes and Mistletoe Kisses. And... I'm so flustered standing here next to Darby Hinton anyway, but this a guy is like... A beautiful woman. It's good. You do that with everyone because that's why you have the buttons, which one of them is... I'm going to tell you guys about Darby Hinton at these, at these conventions because he hands out buttons because every woman at all of these conventions falls in love with Darby Hinton. Aww. He's got this crazy charisma. It's for, it's true. Show them well, the button. No, I have the Darby's Darlings. Yeah. Because you're a darling. You have to be a Darby's Darling. Yeah. So I have permission to pin you? You have permission. Okay, thank you. This is a family show though, but this is a, this well, is a very sweet thing. Too, just in case. So there we go. We put that on. Oh. Now see, now you have me nervous. <laughs> so yeah. And a kiss. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, there I'm pretty go. much done for the day. And thank you very much. Well, no, we have to talk about yes. Grace. Yes. Because my good friend Kathy Garver, Nancy. This yeah, you're talking about me? <laughs> what, quit talking about An me? Another darling right here. Oh, I, I heard my name and I just couldn't resist coming over and saying hello to two of my favorite people, Darby and Anne-Marie. How are you? Oh, I love you. <laughs> Good. Well, that's no, always no. nice to hear. <laughs> yes, Grace, thank you for bringing so that me, up. tell me about the movie. Oh, this is a fabulous movie. It's a faith-based movie and it's set in the 1880s and it's about this wonderful missionary who stars Nancy Stafford and I'm playing her good friend, Ida May, and it was created by a very talented person called Lisa Bennett and she has created it in writing it and we have halfway through the funding for it and so many people have graced us by coming to Grace Grace through churches and through other uh, forms of investments and so we're we're almost there and I'm really looking forward to bringing forth a, another really quality film like we don't have enough of them right? That's that's what we try to do. That's, that's, right. that's what we do with Bill Tillman that's coming out this year. And then later today here we have Wild Faith, which has won the Burbank International Film Festival for Best Faith-Based Film. And it just won the Wild Bunch Best Faith-Based Film. So it's really fun to bring back some of these Westerns, bring back some of the Western values and uh, have fun doing it. I, I noticed I wasn't cast in this Western movie here, but uh, well, we'll talk might, about that later. Yes, we will. There might still be a place for you in that, Darby. Well, I'll get out of your interview, and you can talk some more about me. Now. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> Kathy Garber, and you've got, you've got a TV. Come here. Let's talk about... <laughs> Thank you, Darby. Thank okay. you. <laughs> Sorry. It's a rough <laughs> job, but I'll sit here and do it. It's okay. But I mean, tell, tell us about your, your series about Sissy. Um, I was on the television series Family Affair, and we are just doing a new show, which gives kind of a wink and a nod to the original series. It's not a reboot per se, but it's called Aunt Sissy, and it's the can you, continuation of my character and what she is like now 30 <clears throat> years later <laughs> we have taken and chopped off a couple years and I get two kids and I've never been married and what do you do with two teenagers lucky that I have French around who is Carlo my they assistant French back. I love it. yes French. so that uh, should drop as they say in the lingo in the spring so and I have a new book out holiday recipes for a family affair <laughs> And Kathy has another wonderful book out, all on child actors. <laughs> I'm not in it, you know, oh, because no. I only started at six months old, so she didn't think that was young enough to be a child oh. star. 
But um, she does have a very nice book out. And yes, and we're going to write a sequel to the book <laughs> with the most um, famous and talented ex-child stars of um, that we left out. But I do do a presentation, and Darby is the star of my ex-childhood stars of the Hollywood frontier. And we have a little baby crawling across the PowerPoint presentation when that uh, shows his sign of six months old, when he indeed entered this business. Oh, I thought you were kidding about this. I should go see this? Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll do it. Yes, I'll do um, a private one for your family. Dar Darby has his own there family out there of a it. lot Daddy of Darby's kids. Give me a private one. <laughs> But now, didn't your son, your son was involved with Aunt Sissy, right? Yes, my stepson, uh, uh, yeah, Scott Travis is the executive producer and also co-writer. And so it's, uh, it's going to be interesting. It's a standalone show, but as I say, it's uh, loosely based on Family Affair. Exciting. So, I mean, so we've got that and we've got your Hallmark film kicking eyes. Hallmark. Christmas wishes and mistletoe, mistletoe kisses. kisses. The 26. It yeah. comes out October 26th. That's like Saturday, right? Saturday. Saturday. Well, they'll probably play it. Don't know when this too. is going to air. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hallmark? You mean Hallmark is going to do reruns? Gosh, I, I, I hope I, so. I, can't it. I might get paid for those okay. residuals. Yes, right. Yes. All right, guys. And Grace, the film, we're going to do our best to get this done. Lisa, come around here. She's behind the camera, she's the one that it's always behind the camera. Thank you, Kathy. Lisa right. Bennett. She's locking off. Is is the woman, and she needs to come out here in front of the camera to come explain on. how. Where can people go to, to help you get this film going more and get and also to get Darby maybe as a main part. There is a there is a part. Like to meet my new manager here. Yes. Anybody? I'm new? very good at that. Well, there is a part that he could play. But I don't know if we could afford him. <laughs> but if he would be willing to work with us, we would definitely like to have him in it. Definitely. Um, there's a part of a sheriff, and you would be perfect. You look like a sheriff. Yeah. I could do, I could do, sheriff. Could do sheriff. I just did outlaw. I guess I could do sheriff. So you'd be a good guy, right? But um, they, they go to gracethefilm.com, and that's where they can get all the information about our film, see who's in our film. They can make donations. And as soon as we get our last chunk of money, we hope to film in the spring of 2020. So keep your calendar open. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Thank you.